Hello, hello. Hello. Welcome back, class. Thank you. I hope you brought your notebooks like I asked you all to, as today is a very important lesson. So up to now, we've gone over emotes that have been brought to life because of global Twitch emotes, such as PogChamp and Forehead. But today, we will- Excuse me. Uh, yes, Gachi Hyper? Can I go to the bathroom real quick? You had all this time before class to go. You know what? Yes, just go and make it quick. Hey, buddy. Coming. What does that say? Composition book? In front of the five head? <clears throat> oh, they all have composition. Anyways, Never mind. we'll be looking at the largest collection of emotes on Twitch. Today, let's check out all the Pepe emotes. Because Yay. there are so many different variations of this emote, today's lesson will be broken down into the set of Pepe emotes that specifically have the Pepe and Peepo prefix. The first emote we'll look at is Pepe Hands. Pepe Hands use can be broken down quite easily. If anything sad happens in real life or in a video game, this is one of the most ideal emotes to spam. Pepe Hands! One use that should be mentioned is that this emote is usually spammed when a streamer is ending their stream, usually accompanied with a, anyways guys, I think I'm gonna end stream here. There really isn't much explaining to be done, as this emote itself is very self-explanatory. Rompy, thank you for that gift and sub to Cat's Chest. Just for the sole reason that it is paired with this laughing video. Look at the top of his head! <laughs> <laughs> there are multiple uses to Pepe Laugh, and there really isn't one that is more popular than the other. Is a streamer playing a game, and there's about to be a jump scare, or the streamer has no idea what they're supposed to be doing? Well, you'll see chat flooded with Pepe Laugh, <laughs> usually paired with a he doesn't know, or he is unaware, and the most popular combo. He lacks critical information. The other use that is my personal favorite is when Pepe laughs. Don't tell. What about don't tell him? Anytime a streamer is getting flamed by their own chat, you'll be sure to see a whole barrage of Pepe laughs spam. This specific use is essentially low W, but it's only really used when someone is roasting a streamer more than anything else. Okay, pause. After further research and me just being absolutely dumb, Pepe laugh is just used to just roast anything. It's just, you can just roast whatever you want. It's not just a streamer. That was my bad. I'm a f***ing Pepega. Okay, continue. The next emote I want to touch on, because even he though- He didn't know, chat. Emote is enabled in 25,000 channels. I barely see it. Is it for some things? Let's talk about people think. From what I can yeah, gather, people think. this is an older emote, and it's been replaced by emotes such as Feels Dank Man or Feels Special Man, as it has a similar style of what its message is trying to portray, which is just something really flat out dumb or stupid. So if you find yourself in a channel a man. with this emote enabled, be sure to show some love, because truthfully, he probably needs it. These next two emotes and their oh, wide yo. counterparts are a staple in any Twitch chat. I'm talking about people sad and people happy. And of course, they're more popular wide versions. When using wide people sad, more often than not, the gag is to also type like how a child speaks. <laughs> a prime example of this is when a streamer is playing a story game and has been playing for a while, you will slowly see chat begin to spam. Please pee break. Wide people sad. When typing with the wide people sad emote, there is a fine line between typing like how a kid talks and going full ayaya. Please, please do not go full ayaya. Good point. Or you will get barraged by a sea of nammers and you <laughs> really do not want that to happen. But besides that, wide people sad is also used for if an animal has died in a uh -huh. video game. <laughs> Or if a streamer is watching a video where a real animal is struggling or stuck somewhere, you will see chat spam wide people sad as well. As for wide people happy, really the only main use for this emote is when a cute animal is on stream, like a puppy, kitten, or that one video called seal.mp4. Yay! And there are some rumors about the wide people happy emote, that they all worship the underlord and have an unrelenting bloodlust for anything living. But rumors are rumors, right? For people sad That people is happy, true. Some people do like white people happy death, white people happy death and stuff like that. No one particularly uses them as the wide versions are far more popular than them. And eh. the wide ones are just funnier to look at, to be honest. I think Poke disabled his wide versions and he only does the tiny versions now. I can never make up my mind which one I prefer. I think they both have good uses. I really can't decide. Um, there's a good copy pasta. Only the happiest people can wear the party hat. He, that needs to be a people happy, not a white people happy. Honest. People clap is the go-to emote when a streamer announces he is going mm -hmm. to f your mom. Back Never quite liked that emote. Back when she couldn't say anything anymore, dude. That's who cared. Fuck you. Now back to my topic. Okay. This emote is spammed anytime any sort of elementary school humor is said on stream. 
When the emote is spammed, it encourages the streamer to keep wailing insults at whatever poor soul decided to spend $3 on a text-to-speech message. Your mom jokes are the most popular form of initiating a people clap spam. And to be fair, you can't really hate it, because look how innocent he looks. The next emotes are all related to dancing, and there are quite a few, so let's start out simple with Pepe Jam and Pepe Please. Pepe Jam is the most well-known and popular dancing emote. I am a doggy! People refer to songs they enjoy as Pepe Jammers. This emote is used whenever a song you enjoy comes on, except rap. Rap has its own emote that won't be covered in this lesson. Put up on a motherfucking nigga rap, no. For Pepe Please- I mean, to be fair, there's a lot of genres where you wouldn't Pepe Jam. Like, you wouldn't Pepe Jam uh, country music, right? Etc. Although it features the emote feels bad man for the head, the emote itself is generally used in combination with Pepe Jam or an alternative to Pepe Jam. When a call for video or classical the music, yeah. But for the most part, the two emotes are interchangeable with each other. These next two emotes are the same emote, but just one is a disco version of the prior. Let's look at Pepe D and Pepe DS. Similar to Pepe Jam and Pepe Please, these emotes are spammed when a song chat enjoys comes on. But thanks to Angaku for creating these insane emote music videos, these emotes are usually spammed when EDM is played more than anything else. The last two dancing emotes are used one after the other and require chat to be fully coordinated in their spam. Is it hop and hopper? Talking about PP overheat? hop and PP overheat. Uh. When a song, usually some sort of electronic song, is being played, PP hop is being spammed in the beginning, almost always accompanied with the word hold or chat hold. And that spam will go on all the way until the drop and the full unleash of PP overheat will commence. You will sometimes jokingly see people use PP overheat with the words chat I couldn't hold next to it when chat is still in the PP hop phase. Oh Other no! PP overheat is sometimes used when Premature. something very fast is happening on stream. For example, when a streamer sets a YouTube video to double speed, chat will almost 100% be seen spamming PP overheat. Now that we got the dancing emotes out the way, let's dive into everyone's favorite emote to throw into TTS after they jokingly compliment a streamer. Let's look at Pepega. This emote's primary use is if a streamer or anything on the stream says something absolutely just dumbfoundingly stupid. Because it's like three big factories in the world who is polluting the entire stratosphere and like makes us die, so... You will see the wall of Pepegas flood the chat room. This emote's breeding ground are in XQC streams just for his sheer Pepega farming capabilities. And then reach my goal, dude. It just, it, it's crushing because there's so much invested in, in something I don't get the final goal, right? So the park is not, the park is not worth the fucking mental, mental loss of it. There are also a few variants that were birthed because of Pepega, such as Pepega aim, for when a streamer's aim is just so god-awful. This emote is also mostly found in XQC's chat room. Next is Pepega credit. For when you just sent a streamer $3 to read your message, and the streamer sort of ignores it, although this emote is getting overtaken by the minus $3 dono wall spam. The last well-known variant is Pepega driving. Bro. When the streamer is driving a car in a video game, and is just so very abysmal at it. Also, see- Chat, yeah, you're not being very XQCL right now. XQC <clears throat> Never mind. You get the idea. And for the last two emotes in today's <clears throat> lesson, let's check out Pepe S and Pepe Meltdown. When using Pepe S, almost think like you're using Manka W, but instead of it being used for a scary moment, it will be used for stressful situations, like this dude walking a tightrope across the Grand Canyon. <laughs> for Pepe Meltdown, it is also used for stressful situations, but it is also used when a streamer or someone a streamer is talking to is just not capable of formulating their thoughts properly and they end up embarrassing themselves by stuttering and Elias. stumbling over their words. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. <laughs> and this is when you will see chat fully initiate their Pepe Meltdown spam. Oh, perfect timing. They're pretty okay, similar, class. actually. Be sure to study up on those notes you just took. Next lesson, we'll dive into all the Pepe emotes with the feels prefix, and also some of miscellaneous Pepe emotes, like Coggers. All right, class. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks. Thank you for explaining the memes we didn't know.